Now let's go to the last step is how to install this web chat onto your um, website. Okay, so now you need to go back to Jivo chat. Uh, for example, I'm going back over here. And because I already have connected um, my uh, web chat, so you can go to the options. Oh, oh, it's not over here. Sorry. It is in the channels. Um, this is the web chat. Okay. So you need to go to the settings. And that is the installation. So the installation will give you one line of the code. You just need to copy this and paste anywhere in the landing page you are using. Okay. After you install that, you can actually, you know, trigger, um, you can actually trigger this chatbot you just built. Okay. So that is how simple it is for you to actually connect the Jivo chat with you chat. Okay. It will be a separate channel, web chat, uh, web chat channel. And also you can, you know, I briefly simple, uh, show you how to design the flow visually with our, uh, flow builder and how you can easily integrations with third party and how you can install the script on your website so that this live chat can be triggered. Okay. So I think I missed another step is for example, if in this chatbot, your user, you want your, you, your user want to talk to the live chat support, how you are going to do that in the Jibo chat channel, what you need to do is you can connect with the next step. And in this step, you will ask a question. So we will use a questions of here. And, and we will ask, do you need a uh, live chat support? Okay. So give the user the option uh, that they will select yes. And what is happening up here is if they select yes, and you can connect with an action. So in this action, you are going to use, go to the basic actions and you can use talk to human pause automation. So after you pause automation, because currently you already in the Jibo chat channel. Okay. So whatever happens after the pause automation, the user contact you know, whatever the user um, sending the messages, it will send to Jibo chat, uh, live chat. Okay. So I will usually, I will tap a simple message is start typing your questions below. So whatever happens after this action, it will triggers the conversation to the Jibo chat. Okay. Once the live chat agent accept the chat in Jivo chat, they can start talking to your customers. Okay. So, um, that is how you can use the Jivo chat as a separate channel. I think I covered everything.